so psychiatry referral was a success. So Hooray! Here we are at the park. There's the bubby. And the goal here, we're sitting on a park bench and got his treats. And every time he looks at me, he gets a treat. Yes, good boy! Good morning, internet friends. How are we doing today? How are we, boys? We're doing okay. We've been kind of bratty this morning. So, hopefully we'll get calmed down. How are we, Sassy? My tail is stuck in the couch. But I could get it out. And now my face itches. Ooh, screechy. Screechy, screechy. All right, so. Uh, excuse you. No. All right, I just had to kick the boys out. Because they decided to be a little too rowdy. So, <clears throat> today I'm going to go to the doctor to try to get cleared for, uh, for a new psychiatrist. Um, I tried doing that yesterday and I waited there for like two hours and nothing happened. I was just like, you know what, forget this, I'm leaving because I had other stuff to do, like watch the eclipse, which I didn't actually see it, but I saw the sky change and that was cool. Um... And then I also plan on, MRL and I are going to be going to the park to work on the homework that the trainer assigned us. And he also gave us a couple of tips on, like, corrections and leash walking and all sorts of fun jazz. So, yay! Um, and I know when you go to Petco to get a new treat bag, because the trainer also recommended a different bag. So we're going to do that and see how the day goes, so... Just wanted to check in, tell you guys good morning. I'll check back in with you later. Hey guys! They're sassy! Wait, wait, there she is! <gasps> sassy, 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 sassy. Are you getting really, are you really excited because the boys got excited so you had to get excited? And to get you to calm down I had to kick them out and calm you down? Rotten girl. Oh yeah, and this, if anybody ever notices that she has like this lump, we think it's a cyst. We're not sure, but I mean, we could tell it's not cancerous because it really has not grown. It looks big, but it hasn't really grown quickly. And it moves. So, and it doesn't seem to hurt her at all. Boop, boop, boop. Geek good girl. So, how the day has been today? Because I just woke up from a nap, actually. <laughs> um, so... Psychiatry referral was a success. Hooray! Now it's left in the doctor's hands as, you know, talking and getting all that figured out. So, yay! And then, after that, Tyler and I went to Panda. We went by Petco so that I could, um, try to find a treat bag that the trainer wants me to get. And it's not, it wasn't at the store, but I can buy it online. And also, since I have Pals Rewards for Riddler, since Riddler's birthday's coming up, we got a pound of treats. Which I will be later on doing a video, probably later today, of everybody trying the treats out. There's a variety of treats, um, ranging in flavors from like berry to vanilla to peppermint. So we'll see how that goes. They're all crunchy, so I gotta be careful with sassy. But yeah. And now I'm about to probably get ready and take MRL to the park so that we can work on her homework from the trainer basically I'd sit at a park bench and he has to focus on me as much as he can which I know is very hard for him because he's easily distractible so we'll see how that goes so here we are at the park there's the bubby and the goal here we're sitting on a park bench I got his treats and every time he looks at me he gets a treat yes good boy that's a good boy. Right now we're starting off in an area that doesn't have as much traffic. Well, there's road traffic, but what do you do? And then the harder level will be getting towards the playground because there's a bunch of children. Okay, we've already peed and pooped here. We've got plenty of water. And I think this will be pretty good for him because it's not as intensive. He knows the focusing thing. It's just remembering to do it 
and now to do it in a distracted place and he's going to choke himself did you not even chew that gross so yeah hey guys there's emeril and we're both tired and sweaty so trying to get the park went pretty well um for some reason he has started just growling at people not really sure what his issue is i think it's a fear stage kind of thing because he's not normally done this and i mean he's never aggressive towards anybody he's just growly and barky so we worked on that and of course the focus thing once he was kind of calmed down from that he would focus on me pretty good so i'd say training session went well also for a couple of rewards we took a couple of laps around the field running which is why i'm super sweaty and then there's a creek down here so i took him to play in the creek because i know he likes the creek don't you bud and now windows are rolled down and air conditioning's on i don't care that both are on because i'm hot so now we're going to head back home so training session good hey guys there's sassy girl and there's my baby boy stealing my spot on my bed. He's stealing my spot, didn't he? Goober. So, we're home now. Yeah. Um, on the way home, I was just like, hey, let's get some Powerade from Sonic. I also learned, yes, dogs can drink Powerade. So if your dog needs electrolytes, it is fine. Obviously, don't go overboard on it. Um, so we went to Sonic and went through the drive-thru, and the girl came out, gave us our drinks, and then saw him and was like, oh, can I pet him? And I'm just like, you can try, he's not really been, he's been really weird about strangers lately, so he may or may not let you. And like, he sniffed her hand, and then she actually reached in and pet his face, and he let her do it. And I was like, yes! So proud of him, he did so good to let a stranger reach into the car to pet him, he's not had that before. Of course, if I didn't think he could do it, I wouldn't have let her, but I know he can. So, now we're home. I just had dinner, because I really wasn't hungry before I left. I need a shower, but I probably won't do it till tomorrow, because I'm super tired. Uh, tomorrow, I also need to do laundry and clean out my closet. So, and, of course, little man is very tired, but I am so proud of him. He did so good. And later, I'll do the treat video with Riddler's birthday treats. So now with all that being said, I'm going to sign off for the night and head off to bed. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you've had a wonderful day or night, rain or shine, whatever the world has for you today. Question of the day is, if you have a service dog, name one good thing they did today. I know there could be many, but name an accomplishment they had today. If you don't have a service dog, name an accomplishment you had today. So you know MRLs. And let's see, mine was I ran like two laps with him and running is not my thing. <laughs> so put your answers down below and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Good night, Fluffer Butt. I'm so proud of you, baby boy. Good night, my sassafrasum.